Hi everyone. Today I wanted to uh, go over a minor annoyance I've been experiencing recently. Um, I do a lot of my development offline. Um, I prefer to do that, especially when I'm working with client data. Uh, and I've been experiencing some serious issues with lag slowness recently. I just wanted to go over uh, what the problem was and the solution. So uh, let's open one of the databases I created for a previous YouTube video on database splitting. So I'm just going to go into the folder and go into my unsplit database. And here we have one file amongst others, 800 kilobytes. It's a single database. Everything's in one file and it's very small as you can see. And watch how long it takes to load an 800 kilobyte file. So as you can see, uh, that, that's painful. Uh, if you've got a day of working in databases, going back and forth, opening, closing, uh, that's, that gets to be uh, frustrating. Um, a little bit of trial and error, I finally found a solution. You're going to love this. It's not to work offline. So it would seem that access, and I must admit I haven't tested beyond access. I haven't gone and checked if the same is true for Excel and Word. I suspect so, but I'm advancing myself without proper uh, knowledge here. But for Access, most certainly, it would seem that Access is trying probably to contact Microsoft servers or do something along those lines. And there's a delay in that process until it realizes that it can't, and then it continues with opening the database. But if I re-enable my internet connection, watch the speed now of opening the exact same file, nothing's changed. It's a drastic difference. So moral of the story is you can't work offline with Office nowadays. Uh, Microsoft has some, I guess, initialization processes that uh, just make it uh, unpalatable to work offline anymore. So I just wanted to share that with you guys in case it could help some other developers out there and avoid a few frustrations. If you guys don't mind, you know, leaving me a comment, giving me a thumbs up, subscribing to the channel, it goes a long way to enabling me to continue to make new content. As always, take care and uh, we'll see you in the next video, guys.